A Detroit woman reaching out to help me, Hank, after experiencing paycheck problems. She's been on the job but isn't yeah. getting paid. So tonight, Hank making sure she gets what's coming her way. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester live in the newsroom. Uh, you understand why this is so frustrating, Hank? Yeah, I mean, Devin Kim, I mean, here's the bottom line. She's doing the work. She's showing up. This is hard work, but she hasn't been getting the paycheck. She also didn't receive a promised bonus. So we got involved and we took care of this problem once and for all. That's really the biggest problem is bills. I have children to take care of, so waiting on pay, it, it has became an issue. Shanisha Lee wants her money. It affects me and my whole company. Um, we all have children. We're all at work for a reason. She works as a health care aide and says her employer receives its funding from the Detroit Integrated Health Network. Were the funds not being released or was the employer creating a paycheck problem? And it's frustrating because you can't seem to get on a normal payment schedule or get an answer as to what's causing it. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, really frustrating. So what we learned is that the funds were in fact released, but they weren't getting from her employer to her. A big problem. But here's the good news. Once we got involved, this got fixed right away. A spokesperson telling me today, when notified about the situation by Help Me Hank, we contacted the employer directly. DWIHN believed the employer operated in good faith when evaluating Miss Lee's eligibility for the bonus payment and has ensured us that all funds will be distributed to Miss Lee. Now, we were told that Miss Lee was not the only one being affected, but again, the good news in all of this is that they've taken a close look at the payroll. Not only was her problem fixed regarding the back checks, but also, as you heard, she was also now eligible for that bonus. Now, of course, we're going to be staying on top of this. We want to make sure that those checks come when they are promised, and for her, that payment schedule is every week. Devin, back to you. So what do you do if you find yourself in this situation, Hank? Well, Devin, it can be difficult. I mean, number one, obviously, you want to reach out first to your direct uh, manager. If that doesn't work, you go to HR if you have that within your company. You can also file a complaint in Lansing with Laura. And, of course, that's what we're here for. So if you yeah, find yourself you in go. a similar situation, get in touch with Help Me Hank. We'll work to make it right. You've got it. All right, Hank.